All right, now to our coverage of the coronavirus. The city of West Palm Beach's COVID-19 state of emergency expired just one week ago today. Now the city is starting to reopen even more for the public. Let's go to Joyce Carbonari. She has more from downtown West Palm Beach where residents are going to notice some differences now at City Hall. For more than a year, people haven't been able to enter City Hall without an appointment or a mask on, but that no longer will be the case if you're vaccinated. It's business as usual once again at City Hall in West Palm Beach. Those who have the COVID-19 vaccine can now leave masks at home. The only exception are those entering the commission chambers with social distancing protocols still in place. I have been anxious that since I'm in the building business anyway, so the building department is here right in the lobby of the city hall. So I go there uh, often and it's good to see it back to normal. The move based on an honor system. It probably wouldn't be a bad idea to show their vaccination card. But following Governor Ron DeSantis's bill, which went into effect on July 1st, businesses and government agencies can't ask for proof. Vaccinated, non-vaccinated, I mean, everybody should just be free. For those who aren't quite comfortable with the changes at City Hall, there are still some options to do business online, through the phone and email. Public comment for meetings can also be submitted through the city's website. Now a spokeswoman with the city of West Palm Beach tells me they are excited and enthusiastic to get everything back to normal. Reporting from West Palm Beach, Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News.